What is going on guys, Bisectatron here, back with the next video. Been on a little bit of a break just with uh, traveling, and I still am traveling, but I'm going to do my best to keep the uploads coming. And taking a look at some Town Hall 12 action, we're post-update now. This is actually the first video I've made after the uh, update that affected Town Hall 12 mostly. And things have changed, definitely going to be a little bit easier to triple at Town Hall 12. Wanted to get out there, get some triples up on the board, up on the screen to show you guys. Um, three of them today, one against us, the other two um, our own attacks. And you may be wondering what clan this is. Um, this is just a basically a Town Hall 12 clan uh, I'm in, which is mainly has been designed just for competing in the uh, SCWL, the built-in war leagues. As you guys know, there's the uh, Clash of Clans World Championship. You can qualify using the ESL tournament, which I've done in the past and I plan to continue doing. Uh, or also um, the in-game feature, if you get high enough into Champs 1 and do well enough, uh, you can qualify that way as well. So we're um, trying to get, get up there um, just with, you know, and uh, get, get ourselves into the uh, qualified that way. Anyway, um, take a look at some of these attacks. We got the hogs. I made a bunch of videos on hogs before the update came out on the developer build. Really liking the hogs at Town Hall 12 post update. And um, this was a very nice attack. Got the ice golems doing some work in the CC there, freezing defenses and whatnot. And um, well, um, has the queen sitting in the uh, Pekka. She'll take out that single inferno and move towards the hogs. Just putting them all. Things like this archer tower. Um, makes it just so your hogs go through quicker but you can see uh, a big thing is getting both the king and the queen taken out i mean now the max level is level 65 believe it or not uh for the king and queen so defensively if you have a level 65 king doing some work on your hogs uh it's going to be a bit of an issue even if the rest of the setup is pretty nice for the attack so uh definitely important to uh to try to use that kill squad push to get typically the queen the town hall and the king um, which typically is doable if the queen is relatively central because the king tends to be next to the town hall. Uh, so here definitely a ton of hogs left up at the end of the attack. Warden still going strong and we will fast forward. Nice hit there to uh, Loki. And uh, we'll move on to the next one. Uh, take a look at some of our attacks. This was a pretty close war. We are in champs too. So have to finish first this season to advance to champs one where you can actually qualify from champs one um, but we're gonna have some close wars for sure taking a look at a few of these uh, we got big Harry going in and getting us a big triple here um, this base I believe is relatively common and it, it definitely looks familiar to me we got the uh, is that the king with like a his new skin or whatever which is interesting um, this base, I uh, I think I myself have attacked, and I hit it almost the exact same way, funny enough, uh, as, as Harry does here, because there's great value. You can get two air defenses, plus the town hall, plus start to create a pretty nice funnel, uh, just with the heroes, a few funnel troops, a few wall breakers, uh, very cheap price here, and um, Lava Hound will come out, bit of an issue because the queen's going to lock on, but I like the early ability, get some value before she's stuck on the hound. And um, I believe the Hound is it going to pop here. I guess we shall see. The Queen's coming around. Um, I don't know if it does or not. But anyway, the funnel's been created. And there's a lot of building here, which is going to make it very convenient uh, for the Electro Dragons to get some value. So there we go. We're starting to create the funnel here. A few archers trying to take out those lava pups. They can be a bit of a nuisance. Um, then here come these balloons. Start to test out the waters for traps and stuff like that and uh, E-Dragons are down, nice and early on the rages, getting everything uh, in those rages, they can get the, uh, the chain damage, so you get a lot more value from the rages even beyond the actual extent they cover, uh, has a heal spell as well, nice Warden's ability right as the damage is starting to ramp up, and then funny enough, this uh, um, the Slammer takes two Seeking Air Mines right away, would have been nice to uh, have a test balloon there. Um, but still going to get good value from it. It'll take out that wizard tower. Then the balloons will kind of move their way through here. Freeze and a haste to kind of help push them into that last air defense. E-Dragons still going strong here. Those Teslas just drop on like one hit because they're so close together. 
and then a few cleanup minions, of course. Good stuff. We will move on to the next one, last attack for today. Um, let me know what you guys want to see on the channel going forward. Um, obviously, it's been on a bit of a break, so looking to uh, kind of get back with the usual content, but I'm definitely all ears to what you guys want to see as well. A few ideas for, uh, for future things to feature here. But moving along, last one, have to have a P.E.K.K.A. Bobad, of course, of course we do. Um, this one, you know, very classic strategy at Town Hall 12 right now. Uh, I like the P.E.K.K.A. Funnel, just putting them down, getting uh, not only the funnel, but they're going to kind of meet up here for the entry, so it gets uh, additional value from them beyond just the funnel. And um, not like the widest funnel on the right side there. But I believe they'll take out that Tesla, which will free everything up. Just go straight in. Pekkas, bowlers, heroes, uh, four healers. And I like the healers dropping them before the heroes. So they'll get in there, get on the troops, which is where you want them. Not like on your Archer Queen or something like that. Once everything's moving in. Uh, Warden's ability, of course, over the Town Hall. Jump spell to let everything continue on into the base. There's a ton of value to be gotten there. Um, plus, these Wizard Towers are very tankable. Uh, that's why there's an Ice Golem in the army comp still there, to tank these outer wizard towers. That's one thing for base building, especially using mortars and other stuff to make it so an Ice Golem can't be dropped so that it can easily tank a wizard tower. Um, that's giving too much value to the attacker. So anyway, um, good push through the base, now it's time for the bat spells. Nice and patient on them. Uh, still sitting on the queen and the king's ability right here, he'll have to pop the queen. Uh, she'll move through, get some more value. And one thing is, you have the luxury of, yeah, you can kind of wait till very close to the, uh, like, your push has died out before you drop the bats, because the bats do clean up troops. So you don't have to worry about having a ton of other troops besides the bats left up. As long as you have sufficient time, you're not waiting to, like, you know, less than a minute before you, you drop them. So here we go with the freezes. Uh, too easy, giving us the single, or the multi inferno and the wizard tower in one freeze. Uh, there is one additional wizard tower that's left up at the end here, but it's like one of the very last things, so it's going to work out okay. Still he has all three heroes, two P.E.K.K.A.s moving along, and these bats are going to start to peter out towards the end here. Um, so it's going to take a little while for everything to move along here. Uh, but things split, which is good because the queen can take out stuff. Meanwhile, everything on the bottom starts to move through and clear out those last few buildings. And I believe this was close on time. Actually, let's take a, a second look here. Uh, yeah, that was within like five seconds. So not ideal, but gets the job done. A triple is a triple at Town Hall 12. Not easy to do still. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked the video. Um, let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time. Bisectatron out.